three then is to create the hinge at the top of the machine. If I just show you on the demo, we're going to be, you can see how this hinges, let's see if I can make it work with one hand, there's a hinge here at this point, this mechanism here, so that then we can make the arm move. So our next step is to create that hinge. What you need for this step is obviously the frame you've just built, I'll just put that out of the shop for a minute, a pipe cleaner, two of the very small bits of straw, and two jumbo lolly sticks. Make sure you get the right size, these are the big ones. First thing we do then, you're also going to need your masking tape as well, is I'm going to put the pipe cleaner, I'm just going to start with one jumbo straw, with jum one jumbo craft stick and the straw. And I'm going to attach this bit of straw on the end like that. I'm going to take a piece of masking tape and in very much the same way as I did before, look at that, typical, I'm going to put that along here, come down in, you can see how I'm using my nail to hold that there, and then to come round and underneath, I'll just try and line that up a bit better, see if I can line that up a bit better. What I will do, let's see if I can do, I'll just gently lift that and pull it round a bit and then I've got a bit too much tape there but I think if I just use my nail to push it all down you can see that I've got, what I've ended up with is a stick with a tube at the end, okay? This is going to be the fixed part of our hinge. If you imagine a door, this is like the bit of the hinge that's attached to the door frame that doesn't move. And we're going to attach this now to our stand onto the bit where we had two sticks. So it's going to sit like that. So again, I'm going to get my tape ready. I'm going to need four bits. Three, four, and I'm going to sit it on there so that it sits, I think I'll rest it on the ground actually, I don't think it matters and that might give it a bit more stability. I'm going to put one bit along the front, one bit along the back, and where there's any overlap I'm going to stick the tapes together to make that nice and strong. It's not the most beautiful finish there ever was with all the tape sticking out. On the other hand, it's really nice and solid and it's going to work. Come along the bottom and on the back here. Stick that all down. And that's the fixed part of the hinge. Okay? Now we need to create the bit of the hinge that moves, if you like, the bit that's attached to the door. So in just the same way, we do exactly the same, I'll just pop that out over there, with this one. And we attach on the end there, get quite a long piece of tape, come along here, see if I can do it a bit better this time. Come along here, stick that on, wrap around, don't want to squash my straw too much, wrap around there, come down the back. Oh, I have squashed my straw, I think it'll be okay though, as long as I can get my pipe clean the thread. So the way the hinge works is that we're going to attach these two together and it will hinge like this. And the way we're going to attach it together is with the pipe cleaner. We're going to feed the pipe cleaner through there, feed the other end through here, bring them together. Let's get that so it's only just a little end so I'm not wasting lots of pipe cleaner and twist them together. I'm going to take my scissors and trim the excess off and I've now got a hinge. You can adjust if it feels a bit tight and it won't turn too easily you can just unscrew this a little bit make it a bit less tight or you can tighten it up. Okay so that now hinges. We have a hinge and that's the bit that's the mechanism so I can power this mechanism I can use my energy to turn this hinge but the way this works, because it's a pneumatic machine, we're going to use air, pneumatics, to power this. So it might seem a bit weird, how are we going to get air to power this? But that's where the next step comes in, when we create the pneumatic system.
But that's it for step three. You should have now have a, a rigid stand and a hinge, a working hinge.